Hey, I'm Mike Davidson with Gunworks. On this week's shooting tip, we're going to talk about how to validate your rifle's trajectory. Now, whether you use a BDC reticle or a, or a drop compensating turret, you need to know how much your rifle's dropping at, at different ranges. That's basically validating your rifle's trajectory. Now, you can get some information a couple different ways. You can go off the manufacturer's spec on their ammunition or their calculated drop. Every rifle is different though, and so it's important to figure out exactly what your rifle is going to do with that ammunition. You can also use your chronograph and get some velocities that way, but the surefire way to get the right information is to come out to the range and actually shoot some drop data. Now I've got a couple targets out here at 600 yards and at 900 yards, and so earlier this morning I went to g7.com and printed off a drop chart. Now if you're if you're new at printing off drop charts or entering your information, there's a quick link on g7.com where you can go in, it'll take you through it and, and help you get the right information in to, to print off a drop chart. Now according to this manufacturer's specification on their ammunition, at my 600 yard target, I should be dropping about 9 minutes of angle or 36 clicks on this scope. So what we're going to do is we're going to dial in 9 minutes of angle and shoot a five shot group out there at 600 yards. We'll come back, we'll do the same thing at 950, and we'll compare the two, and we'll see just how close that manufacturer is on his published velocity. Well, I've got my five shot group out there at 600 yards. Now we're going to refer to our drop chart again and, and dial it up for 950. According to the chart, 19.7 minutes. Shoot another five shot group. Well, let's head down range. We'll measure those targets. We'll see how close we really were as far as the manufacturer's data matching up with what we actually shot right here in the field. So We just stopped at 600 yards and picked up our target there. And you can clearly see that I'm shooting just a little higher than what our drop chart told us we were going to. I'm about a half minute high at 600 and I'm just a little over a half minute high at 950 yards. That means we're going a little faster than that manufacturer spec on his ammunition. We'll take these back to g7.com, punch the new numbers in, and generate a drop chart that now matches our rifle's trajectory. If you'd like a more in-depth look at the processes used to validate your rifle's trajectory and also how to use that same information to order your BDC turret, go to the link at g7.com and you'll get that A to Z approach on just how to do that. I'm Mike Davidson with Gunworks. Join us again next week for more shooting tips right here on the Long Range Pursuit.